Okay, so you've downloaded Thesis, and you're trying to figure out hooks. They're a little confusing because he should have called them something else. It's Chris, you should have called them positions. Um, thesis hooks are, are just that. They're module positions. If you're familiar with Joomla, then you'll know what I'm talking about. If you're not, then uh, it'll just take a quick second to explain what hooks are. Hooks equal positions. And this is what I'm talking about. If you go to thesishooks.com, you can click on um, hook positions, and there's a nifty little graphic here. These are the hooks. They're highlighted in yellow, and you see before header, before title, after title, before sidebars, and on and on and on. Here's what, here's how they tie in with uh, thesis. You can future-proof your thesis customization by using hooks and using the custom.css. I won't get into custom.css. That has nothing to do with the hooks at this point. I just simply want to show you how to use thesis, thesis open hooks to uh, help you design your site quickly and, again, future-proof it, which is the whole point of Chris Pearson's genius design of thesis. So here we go. Let's say I want to add something to um, right above my uh, my title here. What I can do is I can go download Thesis Open Hooks. It's real easy. Just go to your plugins here in WordPress, click on Add New, and um, type in Thesis Open. Spell it right here. Open Hooks, and search. And here it is. And you can go through the install process, which I'm not going to do because I already have it installed and it just won't work. So once you have it installed, you'll see it right here. Thesis open hook. Here is the magic, the beauty, how simple it can be. It, it doesn't get any easier. Instead of trying to figure out, because um, uh, Chris Pearson's just way smarter than most of us, trying to figure out how he wants you to do it, what this uh, plugin will do is make it real easy for the rest of us. You can take your code, your PHP code, you can take regular HTML code, standard HTML code, which we should all know by now, but if you don't, it's okay. You can just uh, do some W3C schools to figure out how to do this or steal it from somebody else, which I highly don't advise you to do uh, is steal stuff from other people. But here's how this works. In my, in my template here, in my theme, I have my footer. Okay, this is a just a, a hook position called footer. So I took basic HTML code right here, I typed it in there, and I hit save, thus it appears down here just like I wanted it to. Now let's do something so I can show you how it works. I'm gonna insert some code after the um after the post. Like thanks for reading do, do, do after post. Thanks for reading my post. I'm going to do it in the H, H1 tag, a header tag, so it's nice and big. Thanks for reading my, my post. Have a swell evening. And close my tag. Now I can hit the little ass save button and voila. There it is. That's thesis open hook. It's that easy. Now let's say you want to insert PHP very very easy to do all you do gotta grab just some PHP code copy and paste this is for featured content gallery um, which I don't have set up for this site I have no intentions of using it but I wanted to show you this just as a demo I have featured co content gallery installed it's already set up I don't have any images this is just for um, demonstrations so you uh, you put in your PHP include code or whatever kind of PHP code you could use the time date format whatever you want to do uh, make sure you have this ticked execute PHP P PHP on this hook and little ass save button and you will see this show up right above here above the HTML position which is actually called before header I don't know why they call it this but it's not before header it's called before HTML uh, don't know why that is. Anyway, I hit save and let's refresh. And there you have it. Here it is. Featured content gallery. I can take that and I can move that to any hook I want. You just got to make sure you tick execute PHP. And it'll move. See? moved right there. That is the beauty of Thesis Open Hook, and that is how this extension will make you and your customization of Thesis that much easier. Thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned for more tutorials from Greg Rickaby Design.